Hey guys and welcome back. So today I've given myself a little bit of a challenge and I am doing my five minute makeup look using some of my favourite products that are good for when you're in a hurry and the look that I generally go for if I have to get ready in five or ten minutes this is what I will do and this is the look. I hope you guys like it. It's very basic like there's not a lot of blending or anything obviously I've got five minutes to do it so it's just really making the most of products that can help shorten your routine and work really quickly um, and a few little tips and tricks for what I do when I'm in a hurry um, yeah so kind of a glowy like little bit of a liquid liner look perfect for the daytime I hope you guys enjoy it let's get into it I've got five minutes on the clock okay guys I'm starting the stopwatch now and I'm gonna get going pretty damn quick the first thing I'm using is the Jouer Luminizing Moisture Tint in Blush and this is really nice if you don't want to use foundation or you don't have time because it gives you a little bit of coverage but at the same time it's not like full on foundation so you can apply it really quick, quickly with your hands like this and it's really kind of nice and glowy as well but you do have to make sure you kind of properly rub it in otherwise it can look a little bit funny especially the blush one because it's quite pink so it is quite luminizing, but at the same time it can be quite like pinky. Then I'm using my Bourjois Radiance Reveal Foundation uh, Concealer even. This is what happens when you're in a hurry. Put it on my nose, under my eyes. Normally I use a lighter colour under my eyes, but because I'm doing five minutes, I'm not going to. And then I'm just going to blend this in with my fingers. Probably going to use both fingers at the same time. And this is really nice as well because it does have really good coverage but it's not um, too thick, so it's kind of easy to blend, like if you're in a hurry as well. I've been using this loads recently. A little bit on here as well. And it's just really kind of nice and glowy. Put some on my eyelids a little bit as well, so it's a bit red. So that's all I'm gonna put on as a base. I'm then gonna pop on a little bit of the Bourjois Silk Edition powder, just to kind of set everything and kind of keep me a bit matte and then using the same brush I'm going to use a little bit of Benefits Hula I feel like I can't talk today because I'm in a hurry and just use that kind of to like do a little bit of shaping to the face I wouldn't call it contouring but it's just kind of add a little bit of a kind of slight definition and then I'm also going to use a little bit of blush this is my miniature NARS orgasm It's quite a glowy as well. This is like so rushed. What am I on? I'm nearly halfway through. And then I'm using my Becca highlighter with this tiny little brush. I'm gonna highlight along my cheekbones and my brow bones. And I'm also gonna use this as an eyeshadow as well, which I like to do when I'm in a hurry because I think it kind of works quite nicely. So put it on my eyelids. Kind of blend that in. For brows, I actually don't have the normal brow product that I would use with me, so I'm going to use my Armani Brow Pomade and use my little brush and just really quickly add a little bit of brow. This brow is way worse than the other brow. Do you guys find that you have one brow that behaves itself and is really easy to fill in, the other brow is just not happening. You know what I find as well, using a bigger brush for your brows actually helps if you're in a bit of a hurry because you can also kind of comb them through with it a bit as well. So that's going to do for now, it's pretty rushed but... And then I'm using my liquid liner, this is the new Lancome one that's coming out very soon. I think, I think, actually I don't know the exact date off the top of my head but it's really really good and if you're in a hurry it really works as well so I'm just going to do a little bit of liquid liner. really feeling the time pressure right now. I find with practice liquid liner is actually one of the quickest looks to kind of make your make yourself all the quickest ways to make yourself look really put together. Even though you're probably not.
Okay, and then I have about 10 seconds, so I'm gonna go slightly, slightly over the five minutes, guys. I'm just gonna put a little bit of mascara on. I'm using the Tarte, Tartist mascara. It's actually really good and it has quite a big one, so it makes it quite easy to do it quite quickly. Okay, so I've just gone over five minutes, but we're gonna give myself an extra 30 seconds here because I haven't finished my mascara yet, and let's face it, this isn't the ultimate test. This mascara is actually really, really good. I bought it when I was in Vegas. And I hadn't heard anything about it, I just saw it and it was new and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna try that. So, I feel like mascara is the hardest thing to apply quickly. Like a lot of people would think liquid liner, but I think it's mascara because it's so easy to get all over your face and then mess everything up. I'm 20 seconds over. I'm gonna pop on a little bit of my Clarins Instant Light Lip Perfector in six, I believe, seven. This is my favorite color, it's like a rosy color. And I love these when you're in a hurry because they're like a gloss and a balm and they've got a little bit of color and they just make you look put together. And I'm finished and it is five minutes. Oh no, my phone is now <laughs> disconnected. Five minutes, 47. I did it in nearly five minutes. I've just adjusted the light a little bit as well so you can see the makeup a bit better because it was getting a bit bright. This is the kind of makeup I would go for on a day-to-day -day basis. I have to say if I had a few more minutes, I'd probably spend like 10 to 12 minutes in total, partly because it's not so rushed, but also just to um, tidy up my brows a little bit more um, and maybe spend a bit more time on my liner and then kind of mascara as well because I feel like when you rush mascara, there's such a high chance of getting it all over your face. But I really, really love this kind of routine for my skin if I'm in a hurry. I love that it's kind of light coverage, but it's still glowy. I really like this Jue um, moisture tint, luminizing moisture tint, because it actually gives you a little bit of a kind of glow, like a bronzy glow as well, which is hard to translate on camera because um, usually everything looks a little bit more washed out. And then the highlighter, I think, just kind of pulls it all together and makes you look really kind of glowy. And yeah, so that's my five minute makeup. Hope you guys like it, and I'll see you on Sunday with a new video. Bye guys.